coming into the series, I think you you have to expect every series to go to seven, and uh, you got to be prepared to uh, you know to deal with it physically and mentally. And uh, you know, it's personally my uh, first game seven, so uh, should be fun. How do you keep from buying into all the hype surrounding a game seven? Just uh, block it out as much as you can, and uh, really just uh, worry about our preparation and uh, you know getting fo focused for the game. It's uh, you know, it's not like it's anything different than any other game that uh, you have to get prepared for. So uh, you know, it's just sticking to your routine and uh, just go from there. When you were a kid, did you uh, used to imagine yourself playing in, in a game seven? Yeah, there's always a game seven out in the backyard. So. Uh, Hopefully this one's gonna, uh, you know, come up there with uh, with the expectations. Anjay, you, you talked about mentally in your first game seven. What do you do different mentally to, if they get a lucky bounce or something like that, to, to stay sharp mentally? I'm not thinking about that right now. If they're gonna get a lucky bounce, we're, we're thinking about our game and how we're gonna, you know, create chances and uh, you know, just compete as uh, as hard as we can. It's one of the great things in sports, Game 7. When you hear Game 7, you, you said it's your first. What do you think? Do you have a, a good memory of a hockey game or any sport in a Game 7? Yeah, actually, uh, when I was younger, I, I watched my uh, my old man play uh, back home for the national title. And uh, he wanted uh, he, he was actually in a – they were in a shootout back then. There was not a, you know, a, a sudden death. And uh, – he scored in Game Seven in the shootout. He had two goals in regulation. He had a shootout winner. So that's the first memory that pops up. So like father, like son, then, right? Yeah, I don't think we're gonna win in the shootout tomorrow, <laughs> but, uh, but I wouldn't mind game. it. Yeah, wouldn't mind it at all. What has impressed you the most about San Jose? Oh, well, I mean, just uh, I guess ability to uh you know to to close on on the power play i mean we've we've known all along that uh they have a good power play we you know last couple of games we uh or a few games in the series we we got into some penalty trouble and uh can do that tomorrow night that that's kind of the key is two of the games you lost you guys had penalty issues how do you make sure that doesn't happen because it's cost you guys well some of the penalties we took was to start of the periods and you know and uh they, they were a result of maybe not uh, being ready to go. And uh, you know, the, the, the good starts that we have, we didn't take any. So now we got to make sure now we got to make sure that it's, uh, it's a good start and uh, you know, us dictating tempo. Because this is a winner go home situation, are you going to take it upon your shoulders to be more aggressive, try to get more shots on goal? Yeah, I mean, you know, this is, uh, this is it. It's either you live on or, or you're done with the season. So I think everybody's going to, you know, take responsibility, obviously. And, uh, you know, I'm certainly one of them. And, uh, you know, I'm going to definitely try and, and pull the team behind me.